Nelson Boateng used to be a plastic bag manufacturer himself. Then, he changed his business model. Now he wants to help solve the plastic waste problem and combat the housing problem at the same time. He designed and built both this cleaning device and the machine that breaks down and melts the plastic. The bricks are made from old melted plastics mixed with sand. Under pressure and extreme heat, a paste is formed from which the bricks are finally pressed. The facility can produce 25 bricks like this per hour. They are made of about one third of recycled plastic. So I'm so excited that I can use one problem that is a plastic waste problem that is affecting the world and then use that same problem to solve the housing problem in Ghana. And there's another advantage. Compared to concrete, plastic bricks are a climate-friendly building material. Cement production is responsible for about 8% of global greenhouse gas emissions. For many Ghanaians, cement and steel buildings signify prosperity and success. But Nelson Boatin knows that affordable property remains a major problem in Accra. His house, made of plastic bricks, is about a third cheaper than a comparable concrete house. Some construction contractors see building with plastic bricks as a chance for people to have access to their own homes. So, the thing is, if this is supposed to come in now to help us reduce the cost of uh, production or cost of building, then we should go for it now so that at least any low income person can get access to accommodation. So why do you have to wait? Because the plastic is already polluting the environment. Their YouTube videos have helped spread the word about plastic bricks in Accra. They've received orders for 20 houses, with each dwelling requiring 3,000 plastic bricks. They have their work cut out for them. The problem is we don't have enough um, equipment and space to operate to meet the customer demand. So we are still in the struggle stage to meet the customer demand because people like the product in terms because it's cheaper and the durability. A house with all the amenities for those who can afford it. Viewings take place every day. Recycled plastic seems to be a trend among Ghana's young urban professionals. I think it's a win-win for me to use plastic to build houses because I'm getting a product that is much better than using regular concrete at the same time for a cheaper price whilst contributing to sustainable development. Nelson Boateng has gained international recognition for his invention, but an invitation to this year's Plastic Recycling World Expo in Germany already in the bag.